Thank you. Let's give a round of applause to our United South High School, part of the band, their cheerleaders, and also their silver steppers. Good morning, everyone. My name is Paraita Negron. I'm the communication administrator for the city of Laredo, and I welcome everyone to this absolute beautiful morning um, to celebrate United South High School and the Panthers and what is all about, um, which is this tradition right here in South Laredo and District one. So before we start, I wanted to actually welcome some of our uh, guests and then we're going to do also the national anthem where we're going to proceed with our program, okay? So first and foremost, we would like to recognize our district council number one, our, the Honorable uh, Rudy Gonzalez Jr. <laughs> Representing the Honorable Henry Cuellar for District 28 is Marco Salazar. We also have United ISD board member and secretary, Mr. Ricardo Rick Rodriguez. We have our interim city manager, Ms. Rosario Cabello. We also have our assistant city manager, Mr. Steve Landin. And of course, representing United South High School is the principal, Ms. Adriana Ramirez. Please stand for uh, the presentation of colors, which is going to be taken by our uh, Marine Corps Junior ROTC from United South High School. Also, the Pledge of Allegiance and our National Anthem. The National Anthem will be by Haley Gonzalez and the Pledge of Allegiance by Destiny Escobar. Adjutant, take your post. Texas flag, I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state under God, one indivisible. Please remain silent for a moment of silence. Thank you. You may be seated. So, 
shoulder, arc, ready, cut, retire, the cutters, right wheel, march, forward, march, Thank you, everyone. That was very beautiful. We're now going to ask our council member for District 1 to say a few remarks about what we're doing here this morning. I'll be quick. I know it's hot, and you guys want to get back to class, so I won't take it. But, you know, um, this is something that's been in the works for a while. Uh, we never talked about it. We never discussed it with anybody else but ourselves. And, uh, you know, I told Christy, uh, our secretary, she's always been there for us and they're very productive uh, when it comes to everything that, that is done for me and that, you know, that I have to do for the, for the city. She's uh, always on top of it. And uh, this is one we spoke about uh, a while back. And it was just, you know, to memorialize Dos Presidentes as uh, Panthers Avenue. Um, there's a lot of great tradition in this school. Uh, I graduated in this school and, and you know, I've always given back to the programs uh, no matter what. You know, I'm, I'm about three, three months away and it's getting closer, so I'm getting excited uh, three months away from, from uh, terming out and uh, retiring from the city. But, um, you know, this is just, you know, it, it's exciting to, to be, be here surrounded by, by great people, uh, great young, young girls and young men. And, uh, you know, administration, you know, always the pride, you know, you all have a lot of, lot of pride here and, and it's, it's been like that ever since I can remember. And, uh, you know, so this is why I did this. Uh, that way, every time we come in uh, to this neighborhood, uh, we're able to see uh, who we are and what we stand for. And, uh, you know, and you guys prove it every day, uh, whether it's uh, with extracurricular activities, academics, you guys do it all the time. And, you know, I, I'm very proud that my children uh, get to come to my alma mater, and uh, I wouldn't uh, have it any other way. We had so many chances for, for them to go to other schools, so many chances, but uh, I, I wasn't going to allow that. Uh, I got too much pride, uh, you know. So, uh, you know, it's just exciting to, to be able to share this moment uh, with, uh, with all of you. Um, and, you know, like I said, three more months, maybe two and a half, and, and we're ready to roll. But you know what? Uh, it's it's gonna be a good. It's been a good run, and it's there's a lot of projects that, that are still pending, that uh, I know are gonna get finished pretty soon, and uh, you know they will get done. And you're still gonna have people supporting. You're still gonna have the city backing you guys up, even when I'm when it's all said and done. I'm still gonna continue working with you guys and and, and offering as much help as I can to to the school and, and to everybody that uh, you know to all the product that is in this school, and uh, you know that's all I want to say. And, and hopefully. Y'all enjoy the, the the logo and the sign the way the way we it was printed out. Uh, it's beautiful. I saw it. Uh, I don't know if anybody has seen it, uh, but that's good then. Then I hope you enjoy it right now in a bit. Uh, and I want to thank everybody who's been here and and everybody who's always backed us up and you know been there for us as as a family and you know as a team. So thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, Council Member. Now we would like to invite uh, United ISD Board of Trustee, uh, Mr. Ricardo Rick Rodriguez to say a few words. I think this is a day that's gonna be very greatly remembered. Uh, thank you, Mr. Gonzalez, for what you're doing. I think your footsteps will always be here, even though you're gonna leave us. But I mean, I think you'll always be welcome here. Uh, it's something that you're doing for our children. And I think it's some, it's going to be exciting because it's going to be very well known. And uh, I'm pretty sure the principal, the board, is going to be very happy with what you're doing. And on behalf of the board of UISD, we want to thank you. And like I said, you're always welcome here and your doors will always be open. Thank you. And we would also would like to um, invite up here uh, the United South High School principal without this. Also, this wouldn't have happened this morning, Ms. Adriana Ramirez. Thank you, everyone. On behalf of United South High School, we would really like to give a big thank you to the city of Laredo 
and to Councilman Rudy Gonzalez for all of their efforts in renaming the street Panther Avenue. I know that at United South we are very, very excited. We have a big community that is full of pride and is full of spirit and I think that the naming of the sign really embodies that feeling. And I know that our alumni, our parents, our students, faculty and staff will truly enjoy it. So thank you again. Thank you for all of the hard work that went into making this happen. Thank you. Um, she said <laughs> Let's welcome our assistant, uh, or not our assistant, but our interim city manager, Mr. Osario Cabello. Good morning, everybody. It's such a pleasure to be here. I was just telling Steve, Steve it's like, oh, it's like, I wish I was back in high school because I feel the excitement <laughs> happening and, and the youthfulness. Thank you all. You all are beautiful students and, and teachers. Thank you all very much. We're more than happy to be able to serve you in this community. So thank you very much, Council Member, for having the vision. Thank you. I think without further ado, I think we're gonna be able to go and see the, the sign. We're gonna do the unveiling. It's not too far, it's actually right there in that corner. Um, the sign is already, it's covered, so we're just gonna unveil it. Um, so everybody, I think we're gonna just make our way all together, okay? Yes. Oh, I forgot to mention. Oh, go ahead. Okay. Real quick, I forgot to mention, there's about four signs out throughout the Los Presidentes, so you'll see them, you know, He's separated, one, but you'll yeah. see them at the entrance of uh, Jaime Zapata Highway and Los Presidentes and Cuatro Vientos and Los Presidentes. 